Hi, I'm Doug Inslee. I'm a mathematics professor here at Shippensburg University in South Central Pennsylvania. Uh, today I'm going to show you a magic trick that uses some interesting properties of mathematics. Helping me out are two of our math majors, Lindsay and Mary, uh, and they're going to engage in a mathematical battle of the wits. Now, to do this trick, you can use any number of cards in these packets, but we're going to try to keep it small by using five cards for Mary and five cards for Lindsay. And I want you all to look at your cards and pick one that you think you'll remember if you see it again. Um, Lindsay, just to make sure, I want you to show your card to the camera and then put it back in your packet. Mary, I'm going to ask you to do something slightly different. I want you to take your card and you can show it to the camera, but I want you to put your card back reversed so we all know what your card is. All right, now if I can have the packets back, I'll explain the way that you're allowed to mix the cards. So the mixing of the cards is going to be done by dealing the cards into two piles. and then assembling the cards either the right pile on top of the left or the other way around. So I can do it like this, and I've mixed the cards. Now, Lindsay, I want you to do that. Now, before you decide which pile to put on top of which, let me tell you your goal. You're going to be allowed to do that shuffle as many times as you want, but what you want to end up with is Mary's card on the top of the pack. So go ahead and reassemble them. And now do it again and see if you can eventually get Mary's card to be at the top of the whole package. All right, that's two shuffles. No sign of Mary's card yet. Oh, excellent. So after three shuffles, go ahead and reassemble them. After three shuffles, we have Mary's card at the top of the packet. Now, Mary is at a severe disadvantage because Mary does not know what Lindsay's card is. So Mary, I want you to do one of the shuffles. And if you could put this pile on top of this one for me. Now, Lindsay, can you remind us what your card was again? The Ace of Diamonds. Mary, can you turn over the top card? Ace of Diamonds. So after only one shuffle, Mary was able to get Lindsay's card to come to the top. So Mary wins.